Hello, friends! It's no secret that beauty is a very loose concept. However, most of us still want to meet some common standards. In the life of every person, sometimes there are moments when you stand in front of the mirror, look at yourself, and you only see flaws. This happens to everyone, even to the most successful models. But do not judge yourself too harshly. First of all, you need to love yourself. Today, we're going to show you some people with an extremely unusual appearance who don't fit into the conventional standards of beauty but still love themselves and go through life with their heads held high. Maybe they will inspire you and help you reconsider your attitude towards yourself and beauty in general. Let's get it on! Godfrey Baguma if you try to find any articles about this man on the internet, you will probably come across rough and sad headlines like Uganda's ugliest man. However, Godfrey Baguma doesn't take such articles personally. In 2002, the man took part in a competition where he contended for the unenviable title of the ugliest man in his country, and he won. But this does not mean that Godfrey Baguma is an unhappy man. Fibrodysplasia, a genetic disease, is the cause of Godfrey's unusual appearance. The man was born this way, so his mother looked at him and decided to leave him at the hospital. However, Godfrey Baguma has never given up. He worked as a shoemaker, lived, fell in love, and had a family. From his first marriage, he has two children. He married for the second time and became the father of six more kids. He decided to take part in that offensive contest in order to earn some money for his family. But the fate prepared a gift for him and the man became famous. Today, he no longer needs to earn money by fixing someone else's shoes. Godfrey Baguma is a famous, well-respected man who shoots videos, sings songs, and performs as a stand-up comedian. Vincent Okech when 10-year-old Vincent Okech and his father appeared on the doorstep of one of Uganda's hospitals, all the doctors could do was shrug their shoulders. Nobody could tell exactly why the boy's leg suddenly began to grow in size. The most plausible version of what was happening was that the child had contracted a rare, unknown infection that affected the lymphatic system. As a result, Vincent's legs grew in size, and the media even nicknamed him Elephant Legs Boy. Surprisingly, his legs kept growing. And at some point, they weighed more than the boy's whole body. Because of his illness, he cannot wear jeans or shorts. Instead, he has to wear dresses or white t-shirts. However, the disease does not prevent the boy from being loved by his family and enjoying life. Randolin We all know that most Instagram pictures can't be trusted. You can find too many different programs on the internet that can transform any photo so that even your family won't recognize you. That's why this Instagram model from Atlanta had to face misunderstanding and criticism at the beginning of her journey to fame. People simply did not want to believe that the incredible volumes of her hips have a natural origin. Someone accused Randallin of undergoing plastic surgery. Others thought that the photos were skillfully photoshopped. It's unpleasant to face criticism, but Randallin didn't even think to give up. She continued to post photos and videos, convincing everyone around that all 180 centimeters of her hips are given to her by nature. After all, people were tired of arguing. Today, Randallin has almost 700,000 subscribers on Instagram, and she regularly posts more and more photos to the delight of her fans. Chang Looking at this guy, one can't help but think it was he who inspired George R. R. Martin, the creator of Game of Thrones, to introduce a rare and dangerous disease, grayscale, into his books. Because Chang from Chenjiang Province, China, looks like he just got off the pages of this book. But of course, Chang has nothing to do with the Game of Thrones. His body was struck by a rare disease, unknown to science, which made his skin surface thick, hard, dry, and looking somewhat like fish scales. It is no coincidence that Chang was nicknamed Fish Boy because of his illness. Maramar Kuora The last protagonist of our video today could have been very shy because of her appearance, embarrassed to show herself to people and hide. But she chose a completely different path. Maramar Kuora is a beauty blogger. Her YouTube channel has about half a million subscribers, and she has about 1,000 subscribers on Instagram. The girl was born with a cystic formation on her face, something like a big tumor. Maramar bravely fought with the disease and in her youth underwent many operations, both therapeutic and cosmetic. The doctors can't completely fix her appearance, but the girl doesn't think to despair and sets an example for thousands of people with her fearless behavior. Maramar lives a full life, and her ability to do her hair and makeup will be the envy of any healthy person. That's it, folks! Hopefully, now you understand better. Beauty is not the main thing in life. It is much more important to find something you love and surround yourself with caring, understanding people. See you soon!